welcome back to my channel guys hope you're doing well so in this segment we'll be looking at how we can navigate through the Mapbox GL documentation beginners may find it intimidating going through documentations and would rather prefer to look at the examples um, you find that there is a problem that will exist when there is no example um, of what you are actually looking for or what you want to do. So, Google Mapbox GL documentation so that you can get started. Mapbox GL has been um, provided with a detailed documentation for development. The overview gives a clear explanation of how to display a basic map object on the web using Mapbox GL. Um, it shows the it shows you the JavaScript and CSS links and where to position them in your code. And it can also provide a small JavaScript snippet that takes in a Mapbox GL access token and then renders a map object on the web. The example section um, gives us a variety of examples that have been developed to help you get started. Um, examples range from displaying a pop-up, adding a marker, adding a point, line, or polygon, styling layers, just to name a few. Let's look at an example. Um, change a building color based on zoom level. So, an example in this case provides the final result, which is the demo and the source code beneath it. Now you can copy and paste these examples in your editor and see the results. I really really love these examples as they provide an idea on what logic to apply or implement on something related when you are stuck. We also have plugins and plugins play a very important role whereby developers contribute to Mapbox by creating add-ons or extensions that are not specifically provided by Mapbox. For example, Mapbox GL controls enables the developer to add controls such as zoom, pan, 3D, and measure controls. Now on clicking the plugin, you may be redirected to its um, specific do documentation, which may be on GitHub or still on Mapbox site. Now another example is the Geocoder plugin, which helps you to search for places using the Mapbox Geocoders API. What Geocoding does is convert address to longitude latitude, that is X, Y, and display a marker on the map. Now we have the style specification, and it's used to understand how you can style your data. So depending on what message you are trying to relate to your audience, Style is very crucial and important. Mapbox GL enables you to style your points, lines, or polygon layers, as well as raster data. You can style by fill, circle, background color, and many other ways. You can also visualize a heat map using the style specification. Now, apart from that, Mapbox provides other tools as shown below. Mapbox provides um, navigation SDKs, direction API, Mapbox Studio, Mapbox Dataset ed Editor, among others. Go ahead and play around with the documentation and familiarize yourself with Mapbox GL. See you in the next tutorial.